Hello everyone and welcome back to the, well, welcome to the 2022 recap video. This is a bit different from most of the content here. We're going to take a moment here to review where we've come in 2022 as well as where we're going in 2023. Also, this is one of the few times you don't actually need to watch the video, you can just listen. If you do want to watch though, I'll be running around a little bit in Final Fantasy XIV, so you've got something to look at. Anyway, this year, the Kohi series has seen a lot of changes. We've published over 40 full episodes this year, with almost 50 videos in total for the year. We have implementing, implemented the beginnings of a basic lighting system. We have uh, added mesh loading, text rendering, renderable textures, object picking, frustum calling, just to name a few. We also added support for Mac OS. This was a big milestone uh, as we now support the three major desktop platforms. So that was a goal of the series from the get-go and we have now achieved that goal. The channel has also seen pretty excellent growth as well this year. Uh, we've grown by about 2,600 subscribers. So thank you very much for that. The channel pulled in about $2,600 in combined revenue. That's ad revenue, memberships, and Patreon. Uh, so I want to take a quick second to thank all of you for that. Uh, your support is greatly appreciated in that. And I use this, plus my own funds, to invest back into the channel. So uh, you probably saw the MacBook Pro video um, that I used to uh, develop for that platform. I also purchased some upgraded audio equipment and very recently, uh, I got a 4K display to actually record with. So um, about half of that probably came out of my pocket as well. So, um, you know, I, I couldn't have done it at all, definitely, um, without the support. So I, I greatly appreciate that. And I wanted to just give you guys a big thank you, um, really, to everyone who supported me this year, whether you supported me financially um, or not, even if it was just via engagement, uh, via liking, commenting, or subscribing. Please do those things, by the way. It helps the video. Um, any of that kind of support greatly helps me out. It helps me extend my reach uh, to a wider audience and hopefully help more people. So um, the other big thing that I wanted to mention is our Discord server recently hit 500 members. In fact, it actually happened today, uh, the day that I'm recording this. Um, and so that's pretty exciting as well. That's kind of a big milestone on that as well. So the plan for 2023 is we're going to try a few new things this year. Uh, we're going to edit the way that the Kohi series is kind of run a little bit. So we're going to change it to be a little bit more feature focused. So that is to say, uh, in between refactorings won't be reviewed in detail. Um, Instead, they're going to be summarized. They're still going to be discussed, and they're still going to be available in diffs, but they're going to be um, heavily truncated. Relevant deep dives will still occur where needed, um, but this is basically to reduce the number of videos that are dedicated to just moving stuff around and refactoring. With this, we're also going to uh, increase areas of off-camera work. So this covers things that aren't as interesting or valuable to cover. At a certain point, there's not really a need to cover the implementation of yet another data structure uh, in minute detail, for example. There's no reason to have a whole video on some of this stuff. And so it'll be mentioned, and then we'll move on. And again, of course, the diffs will always be available. This goes in hand, hand in hand, sort of with the uh, last refactoring point. So features that require multiple videos, and we've had several of those even this year. Features that normally would require multiple videos are all going to be released together, but not until the feature is complete. And this is going to be true in a case where it makes sense to call it such. So if we have a really uh, complicated feature that's um, that requires a lot of code, and requires a lot of time, um, we are basically going to release that all at once. And what that's going to mean is we may wind up having uh, skipped weeks between releases. Uh, but what that'll also mean is you'll either get multiple videos or uh, another experiment that I'm going to try is instead of doing multiple videos, I might go with a single longer video for a feature instead of multiples. So we'll try that and see how it goes. Um, but basically the idea is, is to try and chunk things together in features 
as much as possible so that uh, we're not sort of uh, having to do so many individual videos on a particular topic or sort of bounce around. We can sort of have a feature as a single unit that stands on its own. Okay, so the other thing that we want to do this year is we want to make a game with Kohi in 2023. So it's likely going to be a very simple game, but it's going to be a game nonetheless that's going to be developed uh, using Kohi. Um, now, it's highly likely, highly likely that we won't have a, uh, an editor by this point because an editor requires a lot of work. So we're likely just going to treat it as sort of a runtime for now and develop things that way so you can, guys can kind of see um, how that type of game development is, is, uh, is accomplished. And typically for single, um, single very simple games, uh, that is a much better way to actually do it. So um, we'll get a little bit of experience under our belts there. Um, but we are still going to be building an editor. Uh, we're just not going to have that as a requirement for the first game that we build. Okay, so the next thing that I want to do is I want to release short videos on side topics as well, such as the recently released video on pointers. So there's not really going to be a schedule for these. They're just going to be kind of ad hoc whenever I feel like doing one or actually have the time to do it. Um, I'm just going to kind of push one out there. Um, I've got a list of uh, those types of videos that I want to make, um, many of which have been suggested by you guys, and I want to actually take some time out to actually do that. Uh, the next thing I want to do is I want to actually officially kick off a separate devlog series for Kohi, um, which will provide a synopsis of development work every so often. Now, this is something I've kind of mentioned a couple of times before. I actually want to kick that off this year. Uh, I'm aiming to do between six and 10 of these throughout the year. So uh, those are basically going to start at the very beginning, and uh, we're going to eventually catch up to where we are now. And then every so often, probably every couple months or so, uh, we'll release another one. So the goal with all of this is to attempt to move the engine along at a bit of a faster pace, but also to alleviate the amount of videos to go through, um, both in number and in length, um, as the series continues to grow. And so with all that said, I'd also like to mention that this is likely the last video of this year, at least for Kohi. Uh, I might do something small, I'm not sure yet, uh, but I'm planning to spend the rest of this month taking some time to recoup for the year uh, and prep for the next year, and most importantly, spend some time with my family during the holiday season. So it's definitely uh, important to take a break from time to time and sort of step away and recoup and come back to it refreshed. And so that's what I'm going to uh, wind up doing uh, basically for the rest of this month. Again, I might release uh, some small videos here and there, but uh, there likely won't be any Kohi releases um, for the rest of this year. And it's not like the rest of this year is all that long. It's just a few weeks anyway. So that means that we're going to uh, kick things right off in January. Um, we're going to hit the ground running. We're going to implement some pretty neat stuff. I've already got some plans for that. So anyways, I wanted to give a recap of 2022 and a general direction for 2023. And yeah, that's about it. See ya.